Yeah, 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 yeah. Energy, 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 energy. Come and get that energy. Energy, energy. Come and get that energy. Energy, energy, energy. Come and get that energy. Energy, 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 energy. energy, energy. Come and get that energy, my friend. This is the most amazing day you ever experienced, my friend. In fact, today is your day. You just gotta embrace it. You gotta believe it and you gotta come out and be it, my friend. This game is about self-mastery because once you master yourself, life can't deal with you no more because all of this is propaganda. All of this is all fake. It's all meant to fulfill an agenda of some somebody else. It's propaganda. The whole key to life is mastering yourself, my friend. So don't get caught up on all this external stuff because the game is played on the outside, but the game is won on the inside, my friend. Never forget that, right? And I got a great, great message for you today. A tremendous message. And it kind of lends to the same thing. The game is played on the outside, but the game is won on the inside. See, in order for you to win in this life, you gotta connect with your spiritual side. You're gonna have to have faith, which means you're gonna have to believe in the unseen. It's gonna be more than meets the eye. You can't just do the basics and manifest your dream, the, the best possible life, no. You need faith, my friend. You definitely need faith because there's a lot of things that happen that's out of your control. So if you don't believe, you won't be able to access the spiritual aspects of your blessings, right? So this is all about believing in the unseen. And let's get it, the definition of faith is the substance of things hoped for and the evidence of things unseen. There it is, right? Because here's what you gotta understand. The vision calls the shots. Not you, it's the vision that calls the shots. Let me explain, right? Your job is to commit to the vision and not to the people, right? So you know what that means? It means that you don't get to decide who goes with you on the journey. Nah, the vision decides that. So guess what else that means? That means stop worrying and beating yourself up over who's not moving with you during your journey. Because that's helping you. It's only evidence that they're not supposed to be there. So just accept it and embrace it, my friend. And here's three strategies that can help you, right? Number one, anybody that comes into your life, you gotta understand that some people are in your life for a reason, some a season, and some a lifetime. But you don't get to decide. The vision determines that. You just gotta be bold and, 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 and committed enough to obey and be obedient, right, to whatever the vision leads you to do. And in order to tap into the vision wholeheartedly, you gotta be spiritually connected, my friend, right? And number two, stop trying to work yourself so hard and stress yourself out, trying to sell your vision to the people. No, just make sure you really believe in your own vision and then it sells itself, my friend. And number three, you got to develop a greatness mindset, a mind bold enough to believe, right? That all things, not some things, all things work together for good to them who love the Lord and are called unto his purpose, not your purpose, his purpose. The thing that matches that fingerprint, the thing that you can do that no one else in all the world can do. But it takes boldness and it takes faith to align with it. It takes boldness. It takes faith. It takes faith to develop it. And it takes boldness and it takes faith to get out here in the world and be it, my friend. But that's what you're capable of. So never forget, right? Never, ever, ever forget. You were born to be great.